here we go. We did it for Bro uh, Dominator United. We're doing it for Brothers War. Three collector boxes for me. Three collector boxes for my buddy, Mr. Don. Also, oh, we're going to start with his because this is... Uh, it's important to be polite in this world. So here's how we're going to do this, okay? Obviously, six to a case. Opening the case right in front of the whole world. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right? Right. So, these are the ones Dom's going to get. Three, five, and six. So, three, five, and six. Depending on how time is going, might open two of these in one video and the last one and then like a review in another video. But let's see, let's see how fast I can get in there. Speed is kind of the name of the game here. <clears throat> but anyway, Don, you were right, man. These do need scissors to be opened. Okay. Anyway, been uh, enjoying this set. Drafted it a little on Arena. There's Visions of Phyrexia. Puppeteer. Rescue Retriever. Ooh, nice Mistress Bubble Foil. That's awesome. Icar Wellspring Elf Foil. Unwinding Clock. Non Foil. Flame War, Brash Veteran, very, very cool. And Gwenna, Eyes of Gaia, Gaia, sorry, Foil Extended Art. I think I'm having a little trouble with my focus here. <clears throat> Let's see if that fixes itself. Okay, so if you this, we'll just put tokens there. Yeah, that all seems fine. Transformers, blah, blah, blah. All right. Got to think about what I'm doing here, kind of. And I'm a little tired. It's been a long day. But it's 5 a.m. And I don't want to tell you what time it is right now. But. Okay. Mind Breaker. Foil Rare. Blast Zone. Anthopter Shop. Those are cool. Uh, and Ramos. Dragon Engine. Man. Is that kind of fuzzy? Okay. Well. Star Scream. Let me give that a second to focus in. Yeah. All right, I'm going to back off the camera a little bit. Sorry. Technical difficulties. I'm only doing this for fun. I'm not really doing this for attention. This is for me and my buddy Don. So if anybody doesn't like it, they can, yeah, they can laugh at me in the comments. But man, if you're here watching the video, thank you. Thank you for joining. It's, I'm just trying to record this for my own sake, for my own enjoyment, and if anybody happens to enjoy it along the way, then they are more than welcome to see what we got here. Absolutely. <clears throat> yeah, these Brothers War Packs are like made of <laughs> titanium alloy. All right. <clears throat> uh, Perennial Behemoth. Kayla's Command, Non-Foil, Disciple of Kayla's Nin. <clears throat> Mesmeric Orb, awesome, very cool. And Jetfire, Ingenious Scientist, and oh my goodness, Mr. Don. Oh, oh. Gex Foil, Extended Art, Gex the Ogmoth Praetor. Wow. I just think this whole set just looks gorgeous. I really do. I think so many of these cards fit in plenty of different NBH strategies. I think it's actually a pretty interesting draft format. I've tried it a little bit on Arena. And I gotta say, just with the Power Stones, they really remind me... Like, I'm just gonna hold that thought for a second. Here's Urza. One of the five Urzas in the set or something like that. Siege Veteran, Caleb's Music Box, Swiftfoot Boots, Soul Guide Lantern, Adaptive Automaton, Optimus Prime, Non-Foil, 
and a foil howling mine. There's a classic. Um, anyway, the Power Stones really remind me of Eldrazi tokens. It, the, the format reminds me of Rise of the Eldrazi because you've just got so many high casting cost artifacts. And it just reminds me of all the Eldrazi they had at Common and Uncommon that were absolutely playable and limited. It kind of does remind me of Battle for Zendikar a little bit, but the first thing I really thought of was Rise of the Eldrazi. <gasps> Mr. Dawn, oh, Urza Ward Protector. Let's get it into focus there. There he is. You're a luck sack, man. I love you. You just like, wish I had your luck. You are the man. <clears throat> So, Taunos, the toy maker, Gwent Raker, <laughs> uh, self-assembler, self-assembler, key to the city, Cyclonus, and an inspiring statuary. Wow, Urza Horde Protector, man, I want to get one copy of all the meld cards. So, I think you got, so let's hope there's another one in this case. Urza, once again. That's our third different version of Urza in this in this one collector booster box so far. Tyrant of Carriages, Hostile Negotiations, Blast Furnace Hellkite, Moonchainer's Pike, Ratchet, and a Foil Sword of the Meek. Schematic. Most excellent. Yeah, these don't open. That's crazy. Aeronauts, wings, yeah, 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 island. The, the fuller lands also look amazing. Mistress Foundry, ooh, Brushland. Ashnod, see Ashnod? Ashnod doesn't care. Look at her, she doesn't care. Pristine Talisman, Swiftfoot Boots, Lodestone Golem, Arky, okay, and Charbelcher, the mighty goblin Charbelcher. Is slowing you down a little bit too because get the scissors, open the pack, yada yada yada. All right, forest. Oh, yeah, by the way, this set is so ridiculous. There's a black white maelstrom pulse, and no one really talks about it. No one says anything. Black white maelstrom pulse card is awesome. Leads into ashes. Thran Spider, Scavenge Brawler. I actually think that this like non foil. Uh, full art slot is one of the coolest in the whole pack. I don't know, just really interesting cards. Cards that I think can make like a lot of cool situations on boards. I don't know. I find I find that stuff fun. Slicer Hild Hired Muscle Brotherhoods and Foil Extended Alt. Alright. This has been a cool box. Hers is one of the big ones. Uh well extended our gigs is no joke either. <clears throat> There's a mesmeric orb and an unwinding clock. Good stuff. Even Evolving Wilds are done. Evolving Wilds is really sweet. Uh, okay. Simeon Simulacrum. Hey, Painful Quandary's back, by the way. Yeah, Painful Quandary's back. No one says a word. Doesn't make any sense. Woodcaller Automaton. Yeah, Burnished Heart, Ivory Tower, G -g -g Gilded Lotus, Sound Wave, Sonic Spy, and a Foil Mesmeric Orb. <laughs> Looks really cool. Okay. I don't think I missed any of the uh, serialized cards. <laughs> I hope I've been like keeping a good enough lookout for that. There's Mountain. Okay. Urza's Silex, Foil Mythic, regular pack foil, pretty cool card, beautiful art. Uh, Fade from History, Staff of Titania, Millstone, Springleaf Drum, The Vault is Perilous, Gold Bug, Gold Bug, whatever. Defense Grid, yay. Oh, man. Yeah, I cannot open these. <laughs> I'm weak. I'm 
weak. Weak stone, see? I'm weak. Mountain, hey, gorgeous land of low ways. It's crazy, the the, not, the borderless pain lands look about as great as the regular pack pain lands. I just think the art is so stepped up on this. Surge Edgen, mythic, beautiful. I heard uh, anybody who got this at the pre-release did some face smashing with it. Uh, Devastation, Ornithopter, Bonesaw, Semblance Sample, Prowl, and Soul Partition. Very nice, very nice. All right, almost to the end of box one here. We got Urza, we got Gix, we got a few Penguins. <clears throat> it's all right, it's all right. And Warren of the Third Path, you know, because it's like Reclamation Sage needed an upgrade, right? So, Mindbreaker, Hexabus. Swift Foot Boots, Jalum Tong, Wood Song Gong, Gold Bug, and ooh, this one's cool. The Archimandr the Archimandrite, huh? I guess it's a uh, commander only card, but looks great in extended art foil. Very nice. Pretty good box one. Let's move on to box two. Making decent time, but I probably will split this into two videos. <clears throat> I'm just gonna keep going on making piles, man. Keep on going. All right, emergency world planes. Yeah, the full art lands are great. Stone brain. There's the Blue White Soldier Land, Scholar of New Horizons, very cool card. Springleaf Drum, Sold Eye Lantern, Aether Flux Reservoir, Mr. Don. You got a pretty good version of this already, don't you? Yeah, there's your backup. I guess just consider that a backup, right? Ultra Magnus, okay. Razor Lash, Transmigrant, yeah. And what? I guess you got a... Uh, Transformers token too, a laser beak with a power stone on the back. Okay. Seems fine. I don't, I, <laughs> I don't know. I, I think everybody has had a little bit to say about the Transformers and I guess I kind of do too, man. They don't really need to be in this set. It's, it's silly, but whatever. I mean, Okay, Teething Wormlet, <clears throat> Underground River, like I say, looks just awesome, really does. Uh, Tano, see, hey, Commander Mythic, well, that's a pretty cool version, uh, extended art and all foil. There's yet another foil, Millstone, Elsewhere Flask, Gilded Lotus, Starscream, whoever that is, <laughs> either Flux Reservoir, you needed a few of these, right? You were looking for all kinds of different versions of Aetherflux Reservoir. I think I remember you telling me that. So, here you go. Glad I could, uh, glad me and Forest Dryad could be of service. All right, getting through this. Yeah, man. Mr. Dog. Oh. All right, there we go. There's the front of the pack. Yeah, da, 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 da. Giant Growth is in this set too, by the way. You know, it's just, they really need to put more reprints of commons and uncommons. I, I, I love common uncommon reprints. Argoth, Sanctum of Nature in foil. And it's got a lot of text. It returns a lot of lands from your graveyards. She big, I think it's a she, she's big. Let's see if we get the other one. Uh, Kayla's Reconstruction. <laughs> Geology enthusiast, I may try to pick up a brick of these. This this has a, this card has a soft spot in my heart. I too am a geology enthusiast. I am, I am. All right, there we go. Jetfire again and Black Blade of Reforged. Wonderful, wonderful. I don't even know why I'm attempting to. There. Uh. All right, swamp, 
Urza's Command. Hall of Texan. Smelting that. Okay. Megatron, not a shattered glass foil, but a foil Megatron. You got there. Key to the city. Hope you don't mind, Don. I'm just putting all of these retro. It's a big brick of them. You have a big old brick of these by the end of it. I'm going to try and fit as many in my EVA specs as I can. I know I'll probably find room for like all the chromatic stars and blah, blah, blah. Blanchwood armor again. I love a reprint. I love reprints like this. Just subtle little awesome reprints that make limited that much more fun and kind of they themselves are retro. I mean, like what what is more retro? Key to the city in retro version or a Blanchwood armor? Oh, I think it's great. I think that's the kind of thing that Wizards needs to really focus on in their sets. Anyway, off my soapbox and to Keiji's welcome. Misery's Shadow. Urza's Workshop. A land Urza's, you know. Ivory Tower Foil. Springleaf Drum. Adaptive. Flame War. Okay, ooh, Foil Extended Art. Blade Coil Serpent. Not like the biggest dollar value thing, but hey, it looks pretty cool. You'd be a proud owner of it, Mr. Don. Oh. Right. Here we go. With this pack, we will be halfway through your three collector booster boxes. Forest. Death Bloom Ritualist. Oh, Phyrexian Flesh Gorger. This card is just a cool beater. It is. Machine God's Effigy. Lantern Key of the City, another R key. And Mishra's Command, Foil Extended Art. Tell me how that was in your uh, pre-release there, Donnie. It looked like it was probably one of the best cards in your red-green deck. You had the red-green Mythic 7-6, and you had Mishra's Command, and one other rare, I can't remember, but it was like, it was in red. But anyway, yeah, I think you went undefeated in it. Okay, Painful Quandary, again, number two of this whole half case. The Temporal Anchor, that card's fun. Don't you just want to like put that in an Elminster deck? I do, I'm gonna. Uh, Wreck Hunter, yeah, Mishra's Bobble, doing the Marvel Lost Dreams. Gold Bug, oh my goodness, Foil Extended Art, Legions to Ashes. Card is gorgeous, card is gorgeous. Wait till you see it in person. I'm sending these to you, man, probably by, today is Friday, November 18th. I'm probably gonna send it to you, get it in the mail by Monday. Mine worker, huh? you know someone like that. Uh, Swamp, there was a mission. Hey, speaking of the Mythic 7-6, there you go. Da -da. <laughs> Gex's Command, Thopta Shop. The Thopta Shop, Unwinding Clock. Megatron, Keening Stone. <clears throat> Not all rares are equal, it's true. Oh god, I hope I didn't just ruin some of your cards. The, that's the thing about the mystery of opening packs with a pair of scissors and you're in a rush. Alright, Titania's Command Foil. In the Trenches, Mythic, non-foil, very cool. Mishra, liquid metal coating elsewhere. I see a good one. I'm trying not to rush, but I see a good one. Ratchet, field medic. Ooh, okay, okay. Urza, Prince of Krug, foil, borderless. Artifact creatures get tempered steel. <laughs> Card's great. Card is cool. How about that? How about maybe I don't know about great. It, was, it probably is great, but it's cool for sure. No doubt about that. All right. <clears throat> yeah, I think I think this layout of six piles works pretty good. I'm gonna give you the chance. I'm not gonna sort your comments and uncommons before I send them to you. I'm just gonna give you a chance to go through them all. Underground river. Visions of Phyrexia. I, this is your second one of those, at least. I hope I get two. One for my Prosper deck and one for my uh, Faldorn deck. Blitzwing. 
Thorn of Amethyst. Any uh, geology enthusiast should know what Amethyst is. Island Ashnod. There she is in the flesh. The flesh mechanist in the flesh. Lorcan of the Third Path. Farid, Enterprising Salvager. I like the colorless artifact tokens named Scrap. And they don't do anything. They're just colorless artifact tokens. Like, they'll give you affinity and you can need to sacrifice them with, you know, this creature, of course. But that's, that's it. That's all you get. Oh. <laughs> um, Alright, I'm never making the engine sound again. But yeah, Worm Coil engine. Woo. Worm Coil. And an Optimus Prime in the same pack. And a Surge engine in the same pack. Ta da 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 I swear, Wizards loves those Figure of Destiny type cards, man. I swear. Right. You know, if I hurry, I can squeeze all of these, or all the rest of the packs, into the last few minutes that I have available. So I think I'm going to try. And Liberator versus Battlethopter. Very nice. Yeah, let's give it a shot. We're going to make a run for it. I think I can open this in about eight minutes. I bet you I can. All right, Mr. Don. Oh. Overall, pretty good. You got, I don't know about a complete set, but you got... You got a fair chunk of the whole set here. And uh, we'll see what else comes up. Like, for example, Sahili Filigree Master. Let's get a better look at that. I know we're wasting time here, but man, that is cool. <laughs> Mishra, Sigil of Valor, Lucumo Code. Oh my god. Let's get through that. Yeah, okay. Doing just fine. This card is ridiculous. Uh, and I accidentally cut this one with the scissors. I apologize. Uh, I'll be more careful. I owe you one. Maybe I'll maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll switch that out before I. If I've got one just exactly like it, I'll switch that out before I ship it to you. Liberator, Takasia, Kayla's music box, more retro stuff. More of that, more retro stuff and sculpting steel foil. And it's kind of crazy. I don't know, these collector boosters, it's almost like there's not enough of the Brothers War set in these collector boosters because like five of the spots are <laughs> transformers and reprints, you know? All right, so Tyrant of Care Ridges, Teen Wormer, Glint Raker, Glintone, Prowl, Stoic Strategist and Misery Shadow Foil Extended Art. Not too bad. And the Laser Beak Token Flying Tutu Hexproof Blue Token Legendary Artifact Creature Robot, etc. All right. Hey, here's you another Argoth. Here's another Glenna. Blast Furnace Hellkite number two. And Flux Reservoir <laughs> number four. This card loves you. Um, Slicer and oh, box amber oil, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, that was pretty good. One. So file that with Urza and Gix, and uh, yeah, you you probably have like between twenty and twenty five mythics here. I think just between all the commander stuff and everything else. Premium Behemoth and the Arcane Proxy, of course. Very nice, very nice. Scavenger Brawler, Crystal Arm, the Soundway of the Sonic Spy, and the Stasis Coffin. You gain protection from everything. Because you're Mr. Don All. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Alright. Do 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 do. Island. Visions of Phyrexia, number three. Felden. Woodcaller, Gilded Lotus again, Goldbug, and Revoker. All right. I dig it. I dig it. <clears throat> okay. Here we go. 
up. Yet another Felton. The Stone Brain. Farad number two. Acre Wellspring. Ornithopter. Braxian Processor. For some reason, they made a mythic. Blitzwing. And another Foil Thorn of Amethyst. Alright. I got this. I got this, Mr. Don. I'm kind of looking at the clock here, but this ain't no big deal. We're going to finish this all in one video. Alright, Fort of May, Soldier Land, regular foil, that's cool. Ooh, you get you a Diabolic Intent, at least one, full, you know, non-foil extended art. Pretty good. Wondrous Crucible, I like that card too. Um, Blaster, Combat DJ, for what it's worth. Wow, that one's kind of fun too. I guess it's not maybe one of the most high dollar ones in the set, but Platoon Dispenser, foil extended art, and that's pretty cool. Alright. <clears throat> You, you, you have a vast majority of this, at least one copy of just about everything. There's there's only a few things I haven't seen yet, like Mishra. And, you know, if I say it loud enough, it'll appear in the next pack or something. So there's an unwinding clock again. And Defense Grid. All right. We're down to the, this is the third to last Boost the pack. And you get a brush land. And you get a clay champion. Ain't opened that yet. So there you go. Very cool. Rescue Retriever. Self Snuggler. Well Lost Dream. Star Screaming. Oh, this one's lovely. Ash Nod's Altar. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Second to last pack. <clears throat> Second to last pack. The content should be wonderful for a wonderful person like you. And it is my rel. There's like a $20 bill right there. I don't know if this is as good. I guess it's, yeah, I guess it is as good as they say. It's awesome. It's a good thing to have in your collection, that's for sure. So my rel, Hercules, Thopter Shop, Ivory Tower, Pristine, Key to the City, Optimus Prime, once again, and Fade from History. All right, last pack. Be sure I don't cut none of it. Can't believe I have to use scissors to open these. It's nuts. I think they were trying to really keep the humidity out. Uh, that's my theory. <laughs> I don't know for sure, but all right. Thran Spider, Perennial Behemoth, Disciple of Kalis Nin, Soul Guy, Foundry, Adaptive. Blaster and Autonomous Assembler. All right, well extended art, and there you go. All right, Mr. Don. Pretty decent look, as always. At the very least, is decent. But no, you you must have twenty between twenty and thirty mythics here. I guess if you count the Transformers cards, so. Anyway, let's just take one flip back through the uh, foil extended arts. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Gigs. Yep. All right. So with that, we'll close this video up and I'll move on to my half. And thank you, sir. Oh.